Alrighty, looks like they've been at it for a while. Oh wow, you got it looking nice. What's up? Hey, what's going on, Nothing much. See, y'all been busy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some stuff right here. Putting up on the other left there because there's all no cars on it. Okay. okay. This, this place is full of mold and all kinds of shit. So. Yeah. I'm going to empty in this out properly. And then we do the floor, I guess, and do whatever else This is Joshua. How you doing, man? He's, he's the guy that gets all the scrap. So, most of the stuff in those boxes there, yeah, we're going to put the boxes in the dumpster, we're all going to on them. All right. It's not by empty, all these two here. All right. And then we start getting in deep and see what it is. I put some blue paint on some. Wherever the blue paint is, that stays. Okay. Let's start. I'm going to move these out of here yeah. and get some more room. If you need a hand, your swell is there to help you. But all the, all the metal that's in these things here. All right. Right? So the plastic and, and the rubber and stuff you can leave in the boxes. You just take it to the dumpster. What are you doing? Go pro it? Yeah, you did. I got my own YouTube channel. Yeah? Yeah, I've had it for eight months now. You I haven't noticed that every I time I come up here on videotaping? I got my own YouTube too, but you can to No. Oh. That dude is sick, man. Everybody's gonna be like, yo, what's this station? <laughs> yeah, you need to send me that link. Text me that link. Alright. I will. But I need you. I'll let you know. Appreciate it, man. Not a problem.
wrong side. Yeah, yeah, you, no, you can put it right there and I'll, I'll take them out of the box as soon as I'm done with this.
A lot of this got stuck in the flood, so that happened. Well, I don't, I didn't have my channel, but Nacho had his. Um, and he came and picked up a few things with me from apartments and other stuff that I got hired to clear out after the woods. But yeah, if y'all remember when Nacho stuff was out picking up the stuff from the last flood. That was the same time all this stuff got flooded in. have a screw or something holding it. I don't see one. Huh.
Be a nice little payday.
All this should be considered light irony because uh, all it is is bolts and screws in it, nothing too severe. And then this EH don't, uh, maybe they have it, think they have heavy steel, but it's uh, with them only one cent more. Uh, so if I go to TMR with this, which they're already closed, so I won't be going to them. Um, but if I did, it would have been about so their ENH is probably going to give me five cents a pound. TMR pro would probably give me 11. So actually, I may hold on to this regular steel until tomorrow and just give Mike or Mike, why did I say that? Jeff, um, the steel. Not a problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no blue paint. gonna get the mower to my mower guy but it may be crushed when I get home but yeah I started working pretty much like a slob throwing all the boxes down in my way knowing I had to go that way so I had to fix my mom own mistake so Okay. I don't know if you can muscle them over. You can have them. Them You want to point at them? So, yeah. so you want to point at them so I know which ones? No, yeah, well, they're not going to have any blue paint on them. Like this one here. Okay. And this one. Just that one, that one. And this one. And that one. Yeah. All right. 
All right. No biggie. Hey, I appreciate everything you already given me. You know that. Whew. You want a mask, man? This place has a lot of mold in here. That's why I'm putting on mine. I love the smell of all this. It smells like. Well, you smell in pink now. Yeah. Yeah, pink. Oh. Is a little rush, but I'm gonna Listen, I got a key. I got I got kids now, right? So I can't smoke weed because I got to think how I th act around them, right? And I am one of those parents that really believe, yo, you can't do it in front of your kid until at least they're old enough to make their own decision. Yeah. So that right there makes me a little lightheaded, so I don't mind it. <laughs> well, I can't smoke because of my lungs. I'm not putting anything on my lungs. Yeah. I well, I quit cigarettes too. Yeah, yeah it just. I have a, I have Life is too short to be messing around with stuff that could kill you quicker. I, I have a medical card uh, for pain and for, for sleeping and shit. Only at night, but I only do edibles. Yeah. Straight up, just edibles. How long have I been out here? 30 minutes of nothing but aluminum stuff. I mean, there's some steel, but each one of these weighs 20 to 30 pounds. So, like I said, I got a yard that does buy it as light irony. So if Jeff doesn't want to give me light iron, I'm going to have to go some some other yard. It's just how it works. Transmission, a full transmission is a transmission. But show y'all, because this right here is not magnetic either. But, because that's what y'all are seeing, it's just surface stuff. Um, But this is all aluminum. When you take that backing off, gosh. All that's inside is a little rod here and there. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine, ten. And there's and some transmissions, it could be all of them, I can't remember. I believe it is all of them. They have beads in it. So
Just pick it up. Oh. Yeah. Whew.
I'm going to move it forward because it's draining. And they just got that concrete poured, so I don't want to be the reason why they got it stained. So. Hey, if that mower survives. filter
Yeah. I gotta take my wallet out of my pocket. And I gotta turn off the truck because it's been running long enough. That's correct one, right? So that's correct one, right? Uh, there is no mark on this one, but it's empty. Do you want to keep that one? Yeah, there's a four. Okay. Yep, I'm just going to move this one because it was in the way. I'll put it back down there in a minute. You can leave it up there. After we are going to stuff it here. All right, not a problem. <clears throat> So, the reason why I take these out, to be honest, I don't know how much they weigh, but I think it's like 20 to 30 pounds a piece, maybe more. Um, and the transmissions usually are about 200 plus. So I'm already doing a, a lift from the ground with about 200 and something pounds. If you can make it lighter, it's always better on you. So. This one seems pretty seized up. Okay. All right, perfect. No, I need it to be like that. All right. Let's see. Just make yourself feel better. Believe that it's lighter. When you do this. This one has a knob on the end, so it's hurt in my hand.
Okay, I don't see nothing leaking, that's good. Board. Deep breaths. Okay, so these are so hard to pick up because there's nowhere a way to grab them. <clears throat> What's up? So all this got swamped in this flood? Well, some of it's, it's still just an excuse to go through it and uh, get rid of what we're probably never going to use. <clears throat> so. Yeah, because I know when it did flood, we were pulling vehicles left and right out of that road. And yeah. people that lived here for years, you don't see the grass and you think you could drive through it. Come on now. All right, so what else is I think I got one transmission left on this side and then he just needs to know where to go from there right there's only one more on this side transmission wise that i'm taking uh, the ZF 6 HP 16 or something like that. You don't see that. I mean, Alright, so everything on the top shelf is good. I went the wrong and sprayed what I, what, what I didn't want to do with the spray from the floor. Because I hold back a couple of cases and stuff just in case. I think it's going to be like 20 Whatever, if we come up with some more, um, I'll call you back. All right, yeah, like I said, I think I only had that one, looks like a front wheel transmission um, left. Those are a little harder to get a hold of when you're trying to move them. It's a tire. Oh, they were down here and I was just moving them off of the transmissions. Like there's another one right there. So with this one, It's a Bridgestone, but you got. You don't take tires, do you? No, I do not. But I can definitely help move them out. Yeah. Whew. Okay. Whew. Right, you got you got a half hour. All right. Yeah, like I said, right now the only thing I'm going after is that last uh, transmission right here. So other than that, I don't know what else is going because he has pain everywhere. But as I'm moving stuff, there's even more underneath it. So I don't want to take it till he could double look.
heavy as hell. All right, let me see. All right. I cannot get in there and grab it. Pouring out water. Hey, where's y'all's uh, engine hoist? Or transmission hoist? You mean that transmission jack? Yeah, yeah, the, jack. The no, no, the jack. I got one that I don't want to try picking up. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um. It's that front wheel one. It just feels so much heavier. But also, it poured out water the second I even budged it. Yeah, that whole thing was on the water. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure it's That's filled. Why if you look at the wood at the bottom there. All that wood is swollen and deformed. Yeah. That's why I started forming mold and stuff. This one? Yeah. I'm better off using the cherry picker if you can roll it over here and use the cherry picker, but the cherry picker is over here. The transmission jack is not going to help you. Okay. The cherry picker is on this side. All right. Ugh.
This morning I went to GMR, got rid of the steel. Um, and then I went to back to the transmission place because they called me and ended up packing the truck. So I'm sorry, I lost my breath there for some reason. We are over here at ENH with a ton of aluminum transmissions, shells, and all this other amazing stuff. I really hope we get a good payday today. We should, it should be really sky high. Man, what's up with Jeff? Where's he at? Oh, here he comes. Kick talk, kick talk, carry out. Here, I'm gonna pause this. I'll bring y'all back because I he just put his hand up, so it's gonna be a little bit. Just a little bit. I hand loaded all of this. Did you? No. I use an engine hoist to load two. Um, this one and that one. All the others I picked up. I see. These are the, the front wheel drive ones are heavy. Yeah. Yeah, rear wheel drive all that. But I think there's a... Uh, oh no, no, this is my money. Huh? Alright. Let me turn my truck off. I doubt that's my truck. Is that my truck? No. Now I say that's a rough ride. Okay, got We doing whole transmissions first? We're doing whole transmissions first, right? Is that cold? Yeah, so if y'all don't know the reason why I ask them if it's cold, I don't drink cold water. Um, it feels like it doesn't quench my thirst. It may cool me down, but it doesn't quench the thirst. Oh, the shifter came out? Yeah, I took it out. We we'll probably need this one. I think had fluid still in it. That would probably be the only one that did. Yep. You said how much? 80. Oh, that shipped it. Hold up. There you go. This is heavy, huh? Nah. Well, I'll help you here in a second. Oh, I got it. That's your back. It only weighed 160. That one's heavy, heavy. There's two of them that were up front that they were going to save and they decided at the last moment. I think it was this one and that little one. 
don't know. Dos. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Heavy. All right, let's go over here. Oh. It's over too. No. Three more. Uh, Three more. Here, here, here. One's up there. This is one, I believe. Oh. Uh, hold up. Here, you want to do a light one first? Ouch. Uh, you all right? Yep. This one's pretty light, if it would get unstuck. Hey, hey, grab that out real quick. All right. Oh, it's down there. There it goes. You got it? Yep. I know there's one right here. Two more. Two more. Yeah, this one and then the one behind it. But we can unload all this stuff and then add to it afterwards. Yeah, because we ain't moving this. No, I'm not even trying to do that. That's all steel. This one I loaded by myself, so it ain't too bad. Ready? Yep. A lot lighter than the others. Oh, I'm out of gear. I'm moving. <laughs> what? <clears throat> oh, man. <laughs> ah. Well, it was probably that one. Was it that one? I don't know. 600, 400, 1,000 pounds so far. You want to reset those? We still put in a uh, light. 
Cause that's majority of what's uh, not the transmission. Majority of what's in there now that ain't transmission is that light shit. That one should be heavy. Which ones? know what the hell is holding this one what? trying to get that out there doesn't look like there's anything holding it there it goes white or clean Oh, yeah. See, this is the kind of things that I hate. They could have just took those off and it would have been clean. Yeah. What, do you die?
Hey, what are we at so far weight wise? Are you still uh, recording at high, high quality? I don't think so. Uh, light or heavy? Okay. <sighs> Some of it they did really good at cleaning. What are we doing next, heavy? Let go.
Yeah. Yeah. Well, he missed, not me. I make all my shots. What about this one? Yeah. Yeah, it's just clean now. And then the uh, last transmission. that piece right there. Whew. Hey, that's clean too, right? No, it's aluminum. There you go. I, I just bought it at AR two weeks You've ago. You've seen it, right? Yeah. Two weeks ago, I got an AR. Yeah. AR pistol. AR pistol? AR pistol. Huh. Ready? Over, over yonder. Oh, shh. Drop it, drop it. Let me grab the fourth one. Yeah, that one, that one did not want to come up. Almost. All right, got it pretty much cleaned out. Now we just need to empty out some steel and head on home.
So for any of y'all wondering why I didn't just drop it and leave it hanging on here, because I would have bent this. Any further, I need to go to the landfill and just do a full cleaning. So, that was fun. Oh, hello. Alright. See if my mower guy wants that. Oh, I'm ready. So, we are done for the day. Our first trip to TMR made $119.70. Our trip just now to ENH made $559.48 for a grand total of $679. Wow. So that, that's a decent run. Um Okay, so I had to change the end of the end of this video because I got it out. I released this video later than it was supposed to be released. So today is the 15th um, and we'll be doing the drawing for the members tomorrow at 5 o'clock p.m. So keep an eye out for that. We'll be doing it live. And yeah that's about it so please remember to like and subscribe and we'll catch you next time bye bye for now